Petrol heads would argue that electric motorcycles would never reach the levels of power and speed of their internal combustion counterparts. However, in reality, this could not be further from the truth. High-performance e-bikes are popping out with incredible frequency, and each newcomer offers ever more challenging characteristics. Today, we'll show you the latest and most promising electric superbike models, disclosing their crucial data and prices. Subscribe to our channel not to miss out on any of the EV news. Ring the bell and let's get technical. When it comes to mass production of electric motorcycles, Zero remains almost unrivaled to this day. So the reveal of the first fully fared model is a big deal for the entire industry. The SRS is a premium sports bike that builds on the specifications of its predecessors, taking advantage of the 110 horsepower strong Z4 7510 motor and 14.4 kilowatt hour battery, good for 200 miles of riding with the optional power tank. Get ready to cut corners and do precise maneuvers with the help of the Bosch Advanced Motorcycle Stability Control, Jehuan Braking System, and show us suspension with adjustable spring preload, compression and rebound damping. The bike tops at 124 miles per hour and is extremely responsive with a 140 pound feet of torque on tap. The Vancouver-based startup Damon Motorcycles unveiled a Shocker Superbike prototype at the 2020 CES, which went home with the prize for the best innovation. Such high praise was earned by the Hypersport for the disruptive technology on multiple levels. Besides being a really capable electric sports bike with 200 horsepower, under 3 seconds 0 to 60 acceleration time, and 200 miles range, it brings to the table variable geometry technology. 5G connectivity, and 360-degree co-pilot safety tech. The latter feature is supposed to make motorcycle riding safer since the bike itself will monitor the road through full HD cameras and will alert the rider about dangers. Damon will also be released in two configurations, Base HS and High End Premier, which is already sold out. Revealed in a promotional video in December 2019, the Apex Superbike from the Chinese giant Segway 9Bot has already made an appearance at the 2020 CES. The bike is rumored to be built on the Yamaha R6 chassis fitted with a company-developed mid-mounted electric powertrain and most likely a single-speed transmission. Its battery capacity and power still remain undisclosed, but Segway promises 0 to 60 acceleration in 2.9 seconds and a maximum speed of 125 miles per hour or 200 kilometers per hour. The concept retains a chain drive to transfer power to the rear wheel, and there's a traditional foot lever to control the rear brake. Inspired by the brand's SP7 racing motorcycle, the street-legal superbike has been under development since 2015. Today, it's still considered one of the most powerful e-bikes on the market since its air-cooled brushless DC motor nets 163 horses 
and the immense amount of torque peaking at 332 pound-feet. This translates into a 0 to 60 time of 2.8 seconds. The bike also gets three battery options, with the largest 22 kilowatt hour one offering more than 200 miles of range. For 2020, the Belgian company is launching another limited edition electric bike named the N60. It gets the same chassis and powertrain setup, but features different bodywork and comes with a specially developed Heaton racing helmet and tailored biker costume. Energica was one of the first companies to enter the market of electric motorcycles, launching its debut model, Ego, in 2013. This year, the brand is upgrading its entire lineup, which currently includes three models. The Ego Sports Bike, the Eva Rebel Street Fighter, and the retro-styled Eva SS9. All continue to share the same chassis with a steel tubular frame, aluminum swing arm, and Marzocchi suspension but get a new 21.5 kilowatt hour battery option offering up to 143 miles in a combined cycle or 250 in the city. The most powerful among the three are the Ego and the Rebel bikes that come powered with a 145 horsepower permanent magnet electric motor with 159 pound-feet of torque and can speed to 150 and 125 miles per hour respectively. All right, thanks for sticking around. Review the entire list of motorbikes and let us know in the comments about your top pick. Leave a like and let's proceed. Lightning Strike is an upcoming electric motorcycle that is expected to set new standards of design, performance, and technology in this market segment while still being competitively priced. In its standard modification, the bike will be equipped with a 90 horsepower electric motor capable of producing 180 pound-feet of torque. The overall riding range will depend on the chosen battery option and range from 70 to 150 miles of riding at highway speeds. Those who want to get a little more performance and are not satisfied with the 130 mile per hour top speed could opt for the Carbon Edition package. Previously known as RMK Vehicles, Verge Motorcycles is the Finland-based manufacturer that unveiled its first production-ready electric bike at the 2019 Motorcycle Fair in Helsinki. The innovative model is best described as a cross between a sporty cruiser and a futuristic roadster. It features a new rim motor design and has a battery good for between 125 and 185 miles of riding. The fast charging is also there. Like many other e-bikes, the TS motorcycle demonstrates great acceleration, and thanks to the installed 107 horsepower electric motor, it gets to 60 under 4 seconds and tops off at 112 miles per hour. Probably tired of manufacturing only humble electric scooters, the Taiwanese manufacturer Kimco is gradually entering the game of performance two-wheelers. Their first stunning creation in this segment is the Super Nex Electric Super Sport. It was architectured with the philosophy that shifting is the art of motorbike riding, 
So regardless of being powered by an electric powertrain, there's a six-speed transmission in place. It comes with clutchless upshift and downshift features and gives riders unprecedented new ways to enjoy every minute of their skill honing endeavors. There's no concrete data about the technical specifications of the newcomer, but for the speed parameters, the Supernext will get 60 miles per hour in 2.9 seconds and top off at 155 miles per hour. Presented back in 2018, this electric superbike from the Indian M Flux Motors is aimed to become the most affordable model in the segment, with pricing starting at just under $9,000. The bike gets an AC induction motor that generates 72 horsepower and 72 pound-feet of torque. These numbers result in quite competitive performance numbers. The expected top speed reaches 124 miles per hour, while 0 to 60 times should not exceed 3 seconds. The One's battery uses liquid cooling and integrates Samsung cells, offering up to 124 miles of riding on a charge. The model also packs plenty of modern equipment, including dual-channel ABS, park assist, 6.8-inch touchscreen, and GPS navigation. Thank you for visiting our channel, subscribe if you haven't already, hit the like button and don't think twice about watching more episodes about electric vehicles. The links are waiting for you on the screen. See you later.